Welcome back to my channel guys. I'm excited for this video. Today is an Ipsy unboxing video. If you don't know what Ipsy is, it's a makeup subscription box, but it came in a bag. You know how I feel about unboxing videos. They're the best. So I was originally going to try BoxyCharm because I've heard a lot of really great things, but then I heard that Ipsy bought BoxyCharm. So I feel like if Ipsy bought BoxyCharm, then Ipsy must be better. That sounds like sound logic to me. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to unbag this bad boy. First impression, it's a really cute bag. It's pink, it says Ipsy. We know what it is when we see it. We love pink, okay? We love pink, we're here for it. I'm excited to open this bag, yeah. I'm feeling extra feisty today. I think it's this auburn lip that I've got going on. Tomorrow's Thanksgiving, so it's getting a little fancy, you know, practicing the glam. Okay, right away, we got this cute little bad boy. Look at this cute little makeup bag. It's travel size. You can take it with you wherever you need to go. This is the November bag. I never know what to buy makeup wise. I'm a pretty plain Jane kind of gal. This pop of color on my lip, that's my fancy stuff. The first look at this bag. 10 out of 10. So I'm just gonna stick my hand in here. Whatever comes out first is the first item we will be reviewing. Okay, so this is called Julep Cream to Powder Eyeshadow Stick. Champagne Shimmer. Mm, I love champagne. Champagne Shimmer. Oh, should we try it out? <laughs> Let's do it. Apply eyeshadow to lid and blend with fingers or the smudger. Wait, there's a smudger on this bad boy. For best resolve, prime the smudger by applying eyeshadow to the back of your hand and loading the smudger prior to use. We're gonna go for it. Let's test it out. So I'm gonna prime my smudger. Can you see that? Oh, snap. This is blinding. Ooh, prime that smudger. Okay, not too bad, not too shabby. Okay, let's try it. Oh, 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 ah, like that. I wish I had a me. I will not go get one. Can you tell? I'll just go like this. I don't know. This seems right. Dual sided champagne shimmer. There you have it. Oh, it's waterproof. Waterproof and I? That's how I get my makeup off with water. So we'll see how it goes tonight. Oops. Let's try again. So we'll see how that goes. <laughs> we'll see how it goes tonight. I got it that time, yeah. We're gonna move on to the next item. Close your eyes, put your hand in, and pull out. Ooh, what's this? Tart Sugar Rush Lip Sip. Ooh, lip sip? A sip for my lips? Is that what that is? So tart, it is vegan, I do believe. Sugar Rush Tart Lip Sip. Ooh, vegan, I knew it. <laughs> Didn't I just call that? How do you use this? Well, there are no directions, so either I'm an idiot. No, that's it, I'm an idiot. This is what it looks like. It's lip gloss with a jacket. I wanna try this out, so I think I'm gonna have to take off my lipstick. All right, it's off. Tarte Sugar Rush Lip Oil. Oh, it's goopy. Kinda of tastes good. This is giving me flashbacks to when Bath and Body Works used to sell lip gloss. I think they still do. We used to buy them like in middle school and it would smell really good and you would like Every once in a while, you would get like a little taste of it and it tasted really good. This is very glossy. You can tell it's a little bit purple. Ooh, look at that shine. I don't know how many bad boys are in here, but the first two, not too shabby. Close my eyes. Oh my God, I need to stop singing. What's this? Ooh, it's mascara. I love getting mascara. It's called Prestique Good Vibes Mascara. We love good vibes. Let's take a look at this applicator. Curl, lengthen, and enhance. Excuse me, a triple threat. Wait, whoa, there's a lot going on in here. First of all, this looks like pepper spray. What? Flip down to curl? What do you mean? Oh my god. <laughs> You're supposed to put your eye in here and curl your eyelashes. I'm sorry. I don't think I'm sticking my eyelashes anywhere near here. What? My eyelashes wouldn't even fit in here. If you're gonna make this an eyelash curler, I think you have to at least make it the width of an actual eyeball. I feel like this would be something on Shark Tank. Like, oh my gosh, it's a two-in-one combo. You get to do this and do that all at the same time. It's the not being the width of my eyelash for me. And for that reason, I'm out. Seven out of 10. It seems functional, but I won't be using it. Next product. I think I'm getting to the bottom of the bag here. So this is a lightweight silk cream bronzer. Ooh, never hurt nobody. Apply silk bronzing base with Yensa Silk Bronzer Brush for a natural contoured look on forehead, cheekbones, and jaw. Bring down on a chest by applying to decolletage or decollete, however you want to say it. 
for a natural tan. It looks like bronzer. Shocker. I know. But it also kind of looks like pudding or lip gloss or play-doh or slime. All of those come to mind when I look at this. Oh my gosh. Let's see how this looks. I may do a terrible job. I think when you do bronzer, you go like this. That's what I do at least. Does it look good? I don't know. It's No one said it looks bad, but also that would be rude. So... <laughs> The only thing is I like my bronzer to have a little bit of a shimmer in it. I like to sparkle. This does not have any sparkling effects, but I can tell it's good quality. And I'm almost out of my bronzer, so this is like tipsy. Good job. How'd you know? How'd you know? Next product. I'm gonna close my eyes. Just kidding, there's only one left, so. Ooh, 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 ooh. It's another lip. This six-in-one lip tint provides sheer, buildable color while pampering your lips with creamy hydration and smoothing benefits. Let's wipe off this sugar lip oil. So that's the color of it when you wipe it off. This is my lipstick. Yummy. Last night's foundation. Mmm, she cute. No more shimmer. All right, let's try this one. This is really very sleek packaging. I like the way this looks. It's very like... What does say la vie mean? Because I feel like that's what this screams to me. It's like say la vie. Excusez-moi. I don't know. It's very French to me. Whatever that means. This is the applicator. Has a little bit of a bend to it. Unless I just bent it when I try to take it out of here. Which is very possible. Ooh. This one is very thin. The other one is very goopy. Like the Tarte one. I enjoy the way this feels, which is why I keep applying it. It feels like the very, the lightest layer of lip balm, but it has color to it. The more I put on, the darker it gets. So yes, I can attest and say it is very buildable. Well, that's it. That's all of them. In this package, five full-size products. They're all pretty good. This is like almost a full face because you have your eyeshadow, you have your lip goop, you have your bronzer, Oops, and I threw that too early. You have your mascara and another lip that you could try. Overall, I'm pretty impressed. Each of these products ranged to like $12 to $30 per item. One whole bag for $25, that means that each of these is $5 rather than the full price. If you are new to makeup and you want to try something new without paying full price or without having to pick it out yourself and just not really knowing what to get, this is a really great option. I feel like this is a good deal. And I was skeptical. I wasn't going to lie. I wasn't going to say this is good if it's not good i think it's good but that's all i've got for you i think this was a success 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 thank you for watching don't forget to like and subscribe so you can see all my videos that are coming and i'll see you next time thank you i added something to my background guys because um trolls have been in my comment section talking about my plain jane background Is it better? I don't think so. Is it worse? It's possible. Will it stay there? Absolutely not. <laughs>